Namaste. So I'm going to give you a little practice that's kind of nice to do once in a while to do something a bit different um, at home. So we're going to start with both legs straight, lean to one side, pull the right leg back and you want to squish the back of the calf as you do so and then take this kind of lump of muscles here and pull them in so that you can keep your foot really close to the side body and you want to keep all five toes pushed directly into the floor. So the outer edge of the foot is on the floor. Both sitting bones are nice and grounded into the floor. And then you can anchor the tops of the thighs, pull the lower abdominals in, lengthen, feel the back low ribs raising up, front low ribs slightly connected to the front of the hip bones. And then folding over, taking your bind, and then I like to pull my left arm back, which will help me anchor the left side of my leg back and keep my front, front foot straight. Inhaling, press the toes, exhale, folding forward. Staying there for a few breaths. Being aware that that right sitting bone doesn't come up. So you want to keep pushing that right sitting bone back and down. Then inhale, lift, exhale, release. And then the pelvis needs to change to go from Trianga to Kramchasana. So I need to kind of pull it under slightly in this direction. So I just lift, pull the skin of the sitting bones up towards the backs of the knees. Bend that left knee, take that same bind if it's available for you, and then elongate through the spine, press the heel up, inhale, open, exhale, bending at the elbows, pulling that leg towards you, being attentive to what's happening in the bent leg as well. Holding for a couple breaths. Then inhale, open, bend that knee, and then placing it in a half lotus on the opposite side, making sure the lotus knee feels good. It should never hurt lotus. And then elongating, twisting towards the lotus knee, placing the opposite hand under the front knee and trying to press the base of the hand into the floor. Inhale, lengthen, right sitting bone down onto the floor. See if you can take your foot behind you. Staying here for a few breaths. Exhale to release. And now straightening that leg out to the side, opening about a, like an L shape. And then you can walk your fingertips forward and place the forehead down. Walk about halfway up. Now we're gonna do a rotation. So you wanna open the chest towards the sky and bring your shoulder on the inside of the knee. Bring your hand over and see that your chest is at a side angle. Reach the right arm over, keep the neck long, gazing up. Do a few breaths here. Inhale, coming up and bringing the legs together and you can do the other side. Namaste.